This video covers inspection and lateral flushing of the early Advantex AX20 units. Some of the information contained herein also applies to the newer AX20 and AX25 RT units as well. Please leave your comments below and thank you for watching. Often what we like to do is take a look at the interior of the pod. Once you lift the lid, you want to notice any odors, typically a musty basement odor is a good thing in that you've got good anaerobic or excuse me aerobic processes occurring breaking down the wastewater if it smells septic then it, it would be anaerobic at that point right now you can actually kind of see the system come on all those orifice shields cover a circular orifice dripped in that drilled into that piping which those orifice shields kind of give diffuses that water coming out of each orifice and gets even coverage. So you want to kind of check for even coverage across the media. Make sure that the media is getting dosed correctly. Once the media stopped dosing, it's not a bad idea just to take a look at it, kind of do an inspection to see if there's any bridging, ponding, bio slime that's building up on the media or the emitters. In this case the media looks really good. Um, the media is self-cleaning so it doesn't really require replacement or cleaning under normal circumstances. Um, in some cases we see worm case castings because we got some worm issues with some of these and so we have to spray that down but I don't see any of that problem here at all today with this particular system. So there's a couple ways to flush the laterals. You can bottle brush them or you can flush them one at a time whereby increasing the velocity through the lateral individually and that'll help clear out some of the debris so if you don't have a bottle brush it's kind of the second best way to do it um, but this can be kind of messy so I'm going to back up but you can see coming out of that particular lateral you got water squirting through there so if you shut that off go to the next one you can see that one flushing and then we'll just go all the way down the line. Usually you want to glove up for this. Dumb people don't do that. That's me. So once you flush all the laterals, you should be good to go. You're 